So you was a lumper or? No, no, I was, we were shipping out. I was in the truck. Oh, okay. Loading the trucks up, the railway trucks. Right. You got me? Yep, got gotcha. you. Oh, good. Let me have a listen to it. Yeah, travel. Oh, now yeah, travel. And then uh, you can tell me about your cricket. Oh, good. Oh, yeah. Now, if you can say hello for us. Can you see me? And then I can hear you as well, so that's great. Oh, you're, you're over there, are you? Yep. Uh, what's this one doing? What's all these others? Well, they're all, all on you as well, you see. Mainly it makes it possible to edit really neatly because uh, whenever I want to chop something out, I just switch to another camera and then you don't notice that I've just chopped something out. We've well, probably chopped the bay a lot of it. Well, well, I chop out most of it, so I only use the good yeah. bits. Yeah. Yeah, and that's the way it works really well because uh, with so many cameras, I can cut. I can cut. Oh, edit, I, I can edit. see me there. Good, good. Bloody hell. <laughs> so tell us about your cricket. Now this one here. This is uh, 1959. Okay. That's uh, all the drunks. Right. Well, I'm going to need one more camera on your photographs there, actually. Okay, so that's what you're holding up the, the photographs to. So what have we, what have we got there? This is uh, 1959 grand final, after the grand final. Diane and Wooden apparently, and they're, they're all celebrating out in front of Wooden the pub. And there's Bob Trees in it. You don't know who, who they all are, do you? No. Yeah, they, that's me sitting down in the end anyway, and I bet somewhere along there. Yeah, you find them anyway. Well, if you could hold it down this way and tell me the story by pointing to the to the people. Well, that's that's myself here. There. Bob here. That's my brother-in-law there. Austin Phillips. Tom Horns up here, the publican, Ron Lockwood, Clem Stegans were president of the, the wooden, what do you call it, the Hunt League? Yep. Ted Luskin, Pat Horns, uh, Pat, Pat Horns, oh yeah. no, they Pat Horns, Denny mm -hmm. Best. Bert Place, Fred Holman, Cayenne, Dave Mullen from Cayenne. That's all that from Cayenne was there. Snow Rashley, Horse Kramer, he played for Woodner. He was he's a New Australian, whatever you call him these days. Immigrant, yep. Immigrant. Now that's about all I can tell you about that. Pat Hines could play cricket as well as football. Uh, Pat Ed, he, he went over to Glenelg, I think, to see if he get in there. He's pretty good. He's a good cricketer too. Uh, that's about only one that went over there. Uh, and you were playing for? Uh, I was the umpire. Oh, you were the umpire? Yeah. Yep. Uh, we're, pretty, we're all pretty drunk at the moment. You can see, look, look at Tom. And they, this fellow, this fellow, this fellow, and that fellow, they were in the stock firms. Mm. So I, don't, I can't remember their names. Yeah, that's that one. Great photograph. All right, we'll just pop that one over there and tell us about. This one, oh, I'll get the first one, yeah, the 54, oh, 55. Just, yeah, I've got that, that in the way there now, so. I can't see it again. Here's a ring in, and here's a ring in. No, it's not. Here's a ring in. Oh, that's me, Clem Hines, uh, Fitzgerald from Cayenne, Dad Holman, Robert Tree, 
Dennis Bowen. Uh, yes, you know him. Uh, Franklin. Gordon Franklin. Mm -hmm. yeah. And the last one's Knight. Uh, that's, no, Knight's up here. Oh, sorry. He's sorry. the organiser. Yeah. That's Gordon Franklin. That's the Borland. That's the Borland. That's the tree. That's the Holman. Yeah. And Fred, Fred Willie from Kimber, I think. They two from Kimber. I don't know where he came from. Lincoln, I think. He's, he, later on he played for Lincoln Bowles anyway. That's all I know about him yeah. now. So Kimber played in La Hunt, did they? That's Lee Hunt. No, no, they're just ring-ins. Oh, ring-ins. Yeah. You did say that. That's mm. right. Yep, yep, mm. yep. So you're in the team for your batting or bowling? <laughs> just there to make up the numbers. <laughs> <laughs> Whereabouts did you play? Me, Pydry. Pydry? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, Captain Pydry. And uh, that, that's that one. All right. Who else? Right. What, what have we got next there? This one's 55. It's gone from Woodner, uh, Lee Hunt to Woodner. Mm -hmm. And this, this one here has got seven Pydry players in it. Mm. Uh, well, there's Pydry, that's Roy Clanty, Boylan, Wedding, Ed Wooden, a player, Hines, Pydry play again, Ron Gosling, that's the organiser. We, we, we're back here for Roy Knight, Ed Pydry, Ed Pydry, uh, John Wedding, Dave Mullen from Cayenne, Ron, Ron Gosling from Pydry. That's Bob, he's Pat Irons, he's uh, in the stock firm somewhere, and that's myself there. That's, <laughs> I can mem can't remember much about it. Just Whereabouts did you play the game? In Adelaide, Carnival. Mm. So it was in Adelaide each year? Yeah, every year. One time they used to have two carnivals, mm. one for the sort of the district, you know, the Air Peninsula, mm. and you know, various places. Mm -hmm. That used to be in February, this one used to be in March. Mm -hmm. It just teams. Used mm -hmm. This used to be the biggest one. Mm -hmm. A lot more teams in it. Which oval did you play on? Oh, um, various? Yeah, I played in Adelaide Oval one time. Great. <laughs> but there they had two, two pitches in the oval instead of one. Right. The bloke of Snickers. Snicker ball for six. Like <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they played Kensington. Oh, all, all the ovals in Adelaide anyway. Mm, Kensington, another nice oval. Yeah, I can't remember, but been out there. Yeah, it'd be great anyway. Yeah. All right, what else have we got there? No, no, that no, are just mine, my photos. Well, tell us about those then. Well, there's Tummy Bay, 1970. You know Tummy Bay? So you moved to Tumby Bay then? Uh, Port Neal. Oh, Port Neal. Mm. Dennis Davey, Angara, myself. Just hold it just over there, that's it. Leon Cameron. Yep. Uh, bloody head of a band of fishers. Can't remember his name. Oh, another Angara fella. Oh, good boy, that fella. Oh, Dennis. Not Dennis, Davey. Uh, Don Davey. Don Davey. Dad, Don Davey. Yeah, you can't join in, Philip, otherwise you... Yeah, no, that's right. Uh, oh, no, we... oh, it's all down here anyway. Ben... Berryman. Ken Berryman. Rodney. Hurst. Hurst, uh, uh... Newton. Newton, that's right. Ken Bodie, the organiser, and uh, the bloke out the pub. Dunn. Uh, Dunn. Dean Dunn. Mm. Dean Dunn. He apparently oh, was uh, a mean uh, cricketer. And his brother too, I think. This one. Mm. Dean, he's a good bowler, yeah. Mm. Yeah, slow bowler. He was a captain, I think, wasn't he? Yeah. Yes. He Tumby. Mm -hmm. Rodney Marsh, Lipson. Mm -hmm. Another Lipson. Or Rambers, or one of the two. Not Rambers, the Colts, I mean. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's, that's the 1970. So you would have played cricket at Yellander Flat? No, no, it was only two, two three Tumby teams. Mm -hmm. Angara, Lipson and Port Neal. Mm -hmm. yeah, Did you play cricket with Butch Fitzgerald or against Butch Fitzgerald? N not against him. I don't think he was playing when I was there. No. Oh, could have been. I can't, I can't remember. Mm. I know, know Butch pretty well. 
That's that one. That's oh, this is the first one. Did you ever play against Ross? Who? Ross Fitzgerald. Uh, no. <laughs> No, 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 no. I know Ross, I went out there shooting one time. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you that story later. If you know <laughs> okay. Uh, this is the first one I went to, Lock Mount Hope. Great. That's when I was still at Sharinga. Mm -hmm. There's Lock Man, you can see the names there. John Baskin from Elliston, uh, Marnie, Cutler Marnie, Brian Marnie, me. Uh, it's uh, from Lincoln, I don't respect this guy, Colin Hagers and one of the Daddles, Herb Higgins, Hal of Ponsford, Ron, Ron Rulum. Uh, he came from Lock, he was the organiser, uh, Roberts, Des Roberts, Nelson Dale Grubb, Noel Handham, and down here is Bill LeBrun. <laughs> A good team, that one. That was us just carrying the drinks, I think. <laughs> it was only 18 or something. Wow, but you got to go to Adelaide. Was that your first trip to Adelaide? Oh, we lived in Adelaide during the war years. Oh, really? Yeah. Why was that? Oh, I'm not sure, but whether my father went over to join up or, or not, but the work back in those during the war, they had... Sorry, Philip, would you mind to get the door closed? Yeah, thanks, mate. You have to do what you're told. You know, go work where you're told to. Yes. So they found out he was shearer, you see, so he had to go way shearing. Mm. And he way up at Tipperborough. You know where Tipperborough is? No. Northwest corner of New South Wales. Mm -hmm. When my young brother got drowned in the Gibbled, Gilberton mm. swimming hole. Sorry about that, yeah. Yeah, so how, how long it took to, that's back in 1942. Mm. How long it took him to find out and get back home? My mother must be frantic. Mm. But I don't remember too much. We was palmed out, you know. Mm. And uh, me, my mother's father and grandmother come up and looked after her, I think. Mm. But that, that's uh, the first one I went to. Mm -hmm. And this is a proud moment. This one, you read that one. Bridport. Oh, Beachport Cricket Team, Millicent and District Association Premiers A Grade, second team of the year, yeah. 1978-79. So yeah. tell us about this it's team. South, South East Cricket Association Team of the Year. Mm. Because good cricketers are there. There's an S Cummings there. Yeah, that's me again. <laughs> so you could play a little bit. Oh yeah, right. Well, a little bit, yeah. A little bit, yeah. So you're in the team for your batting or bowling? I was just to make up the side, I think. Just to make up the side in the team of the year. So you were, you were making up the making up the side and you got to bowl? No, I, I couldn't bowl. I you got the bat? It. Oh, you're a wicketkeeper? Yeah. But, uh, right. Well, obviously the wicketkeeper's there just to make up the numbers, really. So. That's the only, only time I really play for them because they, they got a big grade after that. Mm. And I was I, I get a bit long in the tooth, so... I, mm. I, Captain the B grade. Very good. And that's a lot better than playing A grade. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. yeah that's, that's that. And that's all I can t tell you about. Well, tell me about playing cricket at Syringa. Oh, cricket at Syringa. Yeah, yeah. yeah uh, well, like I said, I only remember watching cricket there, mm -hmm. not to play cricket there. Mm -hmm. All I can remember there was two two Agus boys playing. That's mm -hmm. from Tungata. So. Mm -hmm. They were Bob and Andy. Andy was pretty fairly fast bowler. And then there's two, after the wall, there's two. There's Rabbit Trapper living at the Eaton House of Lake Hamilton. He was a good cricket. He used to play for us. Mm -hmm. I remember him. Then there was one of the leg station hands. He was mm -hmm. pretty good cricket. He played too. But, but I don't remember playing there. Then we, after that, we had all cricket teams played at Elliston. What was the surface like at Sharinga? Uh, was that because the surface at Sharinga was not very good? No, no. All, all the teams come and played at Elliston. Mm. Anyway, it had two ovals. There's only four teams. Right. Whereabouts were the ovals? Uh, well, just adjacent to the other one. The the current one. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And. Uh, 
I played for Sheringa and I was 14 year old, I used to open the batting. Mm -hmm. if, <laughs> if I couldn't get half the sides to run, well, I was failed. I remember I got 27 one day and I got 14 of them. So, <laughs> um, <laughs> you know, playing the likes of Jack Baskin and mm. Peter Penner and Brian Talbot and Kevin Mullen. Who could all play? Uh, they were good bowlers, you know. Mm. Well, Peter Penner and Jack Baskin were fast. Mm -hmm. Ryan Colbert and Kevin Mullins were like good swing bowlers. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, then, uh, then you get Les Akers, he was pretty ferocious. Mm -hmm. I don't, rem don't remember much about Max now. What was the pitch made of? A mouthoid. Yeah. A mouthoid back in them days. Yeah. Uh, that's just... Was the, uh, was, what about the oval, was that a bit rocky? Oh, uh, the, uh, other one over there then was, you know, pretty just ploughed up ground. Mm. I don't know whether it ever got green or not, but I can't remember it. The uh, other one was pretty good, mm. just in front of the hospital. Mm. Yeah, it was a good novel. Mm. I remember uh, <laughs> we had a, used to have Easter carnivals there one time. And, uh, Kangaroo Island come over one time, one year I think, and Boyle used to come down and a few other associations used to play there. Mm. And I was playing on this number two over one time and I got 89 not out. Mm -hmm. That's the best I've ever bet in my life. Mm -hmm. But played the next next day, duck. <laughs> <laughs> one from the other. Uh, well, it's a bit like a, a premiership, ha premiership hangover, I guess. <laughs> uh, Sheringa never got a premiership. Hmm. No, no we, did, we just made up the team because it was uh, Sheringa, Elliston, Mount Wedge and Colton. Mm -hmm. Oh, I might, I might be five, it Talia too, at that time. Mm -hmm. And Talia and Colton merged, so that made four teams. But when we played football, there was only three teams. Elliston, Mount, Mount Wedge, Colton. And Port Kenny. And you played for? I played one game for Elliston. Yeah. That's when there used to be an old showground. Mm -hmm. Get pretty windy up there. Mm. And I played on a guy when I played there. Mm -hmm. Ken Kenny, Ken Kelly, well, he played in centre or somewhere, got the ball and kicked it, marked it, kicked it, marked it, kicked it, <laughs> marked it, and kicked the goal. He did? Ken Kelly. <laughs> <laughs> That's how windy it was. Mm. God, a bloody girl. That's, that's the only time I played because they must have been short or something. My two cousins and myself went up and played for them. I don't know whether the other two played or not, but I didn't because I wasn't a footballer. Who, who were the good players in that team? Well, of course, Kelly's, of course. Mm -hmm. Campbell, he's, he didn't really live there. He just came in yeah. home. And there's Ken Kelly. Oh, good. <laughs> Name them all. Ken Kelly, my age. Uh, Jack Kelly. Oh, I know them all. <laughs> I can't remember. I'll know it tomorrow. Mm. And what about the other teams? Who were the star players? Oh, I, I wouldn't have a clue because I, mm. I wasn't into football. Mm. What can you tell me about Tony Tree? T Tony Tree? Mm. Bob's son, Jack, that's Butch, you mean? Oh, so Tony Tree's Butch, is it? Butch is, Butch is Bob's son. Hmm. Right, so who's Tony Tree then? Tony Tree's Bob, Butch. That's so Bob. that's Butch, is it? Yeah. Oh, well, okay, well, I didn't know who I was talking to, because I, I, I know him as Butch, not Tony. Oh, yeah, that's Tony. That's right, Butch. okay. Yeah, uh, he's Tony. Uh, he... And I was only talking to him on the phone, so I didn't know who I was talking oh, to. Oh, yeah, he's Bob's son. Mm. And Bob's my brother-in-law. Mm. You knew that? No. Oh. Go on then. Yeah. He had my brother-in-law. Mm. I don't mean to say I knew him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And Butch, he could play a little bit? Apparently, yes. I know his son was a bit of a star in the 2018 Premiership. Was he? Yeah. I'm pretty sure that was his lad. There was a tree who played really well in that game. Yeah, well, wouldn't it have Elliston? No, Elliston. Oh, that'd be his son, then. would be one tree down there. Mm. That'd be... What's his name? What's his name? 
No, you're not there. Philip, uh, what's the name of the... Dawn, uh, Dawn, 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 D-O-R-N, Dawn. Oh, Gorn. Gorn. Yeah, and he played in the 2018 so, team. Yeah. He kicked a really good goal. Yeah, and um, Kiwi Inforders as well, mm. which is his cousins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Yeah, well, of course, uh, well, Jay played in it. Um, Matt didn't because he was... Oh, he might have been over here, Matt. He was over this way uh, playing for... Um, he was in Clare Valley, wasn't he? Oh, no, he played for Manham. Oh, Manham it was. Yeah, yeah, so he's playing for Manham. And <laughs> this is 2018 when Elliston won the Premiership. And I thought Butch was involved then too. I thought he was... No, no, I think it was... Who was coaching then? Was it... Um, was it Sleepy? No, I couldn't tell you. He was coaching. I think Butch might have been selector or something. Yeah, he was involved. Yeah, he has to be. Anyway, all right. Well, very good. Well, Stuart, you've been great. Thanks very much, man. But you're finished. Yeah.